loses power and jumps a bit as well, maybe because of that. Much more powerful, much more powerful. So we've got now these uh, two saws from Ryobi, reciprocating saws, and I can tell you straight away uh, from the tests that I've done, then uh, the newer one is uh, better, much better, not only because it's a bit sexier, uh, but there are some other reasons. And you can see my tests at the end of this video, so uh, let me now quickly discuss why I prefer this one. So, um, well, the looks, it looks much better, it's kind of a little bit sexier, they're, in a way they're similar, but they're not, they're, they're quite different. Uh, so um, this one has got this handle kind of going up, so they made a kind of a recess here, so uh, now uh, it's going kind of down, how to, so, so, yeah, like this, maybe you can see it like this, and it makes this bit goes kind of up higher, so it looks a bit sexier, and it's a little bit more comfortable to hold, now, simply because the, the battery has been moved backwards. So as you can see with this one, the battery is kind of in the center. And usually, or very often when we hold it, um, the one hand is kind of further and therefore it's heavier. So we need more weight at the back because this one has, it's closer to the body. It's easier to hold. So with, in this case, you know, it's a little bit heavier, just a little bit. And it's already, uh, it makes a difference. Another uh, thing is that well, uh, vibrations. Supposedly, this one has got this anti-vibration thing, but really, it's more like a gimmick. The only time I can feel the difference is when I hold it kind of dry in the air, and then I press it, go to the maximum, then I can feel maybe this one vibrating more. But it also could be because it goes uh, to 300, 400, um, 3,400 uh, revolutions per minute, as opposed to uh, 3,100, so uh, that could be a difference. And the moment we start actually sawing anything, uh, cutting anything, then uh, they both vibrate, you know. So this is more of a gimmick, and also it's not very high quality, so I think for this to work it would need to be like a really high quality, it would make it more expensive. And this bit here, it's just a gimmick, it doesn't do anything, it's just a rubber that looks like this one. So all in all, uh, maybe if it were in two places and it, if it were good quality it would make a difference, but really it doesn't. By the way, if you want to hear that there is a bit of a difference in the noise, let's listen. So the newer one definitely faster, you, we can hear it from uh, from the noise now. They're more or less both loud, you know, they're loud enough, I wouldn't say that one is louder than the other. Yeah, but definitely this one is slower as you can hear. Now, the, for me the biggest selling point actually is something else is uh, the switch here. So this one has got a permanent switch, so to say. So if I uh, press the button, the trigger, it just goes. And then if I want to lock it, I move the switch, uh, the side switch to locked position, and now it's locked. And then when I unlock it, it's constantly unlocked. Whereas with this one, it's got this annoying thing. It's got this side uh, switch that can, can be pressed from both sides, but every time I wanna I want to press the trigger, I need to press this switch either this way or that way, and it's annoying. It's annoying either way, so, um, you know, maybe if I do one cut, it's fine, but if I need to do a longer job, you know, it becomes really annoying. So, just because of that, uh, that makes a difference. Now, uh, in my tests, you will also see that this one is much more powerful. It could be, uh, you know, because it's got... Um, higher speed as well, a little bit, could be both, it's stronger and, and it's got higher speed. It keeps going uh, and this one very often starts kind of like struggling, shaking and I need to restart and cannot go really. Whereas this one continues going when this one fails, you know, and um, and it, it is a, sometimes it is a big difference, substantial difference. So definitely the new one is um, way forward. So that's what they look like. 
uh, again very similar from uh, this side and then uh, that's what they look like from the other side maybe a different view maybe you can see it like this uh, so you know the looks are kind of similar I don't know not very no I mean this one is much sexier now uh, they come uh, when when you buy them uh, you should probably get what I got which is the the new one gets uh, this uh, this blade one blade whereas the old one gets two blades this one and the other one uh, for metal uh, I couldn't find it anything but it's just more teeth basically now these both saws they have uh, easy uh, blade changing so we just uh, lift this bit put this thing in if I can just find it here we go bang done and it's the same with this one we just lift it and place the blade in so the both uh, really the blades are really easy uh, to use now these blades are very similar uh, this one however the newer one the blades are uh, slightly deeper or, or longer they're sorry the teeth they're kind of longer deeper so and I think that's a gives a little bit more advantage uh, couldn't uh, figure out it's 400 like you know like 100 <laughs> percent uh, because I haven't been testing it but it seems to me like these cut a little bit better as well so um, definitely go for the newer one and they retail at similar prices I think at the moment so absolutely go for the for the new one now uh, watch the tests and I hope you will enjoy them you know with the links you'll find the links underneath the video thank you for using my uh, affiliate links um, or you can go to Ryobi's website I'm not affiliated with them in any way so uh, Ryobi runs lots of promotions in the UK especially I don't know how about other countries but in the UK they often run uh, promotions and recently there was a crazy promotion like 40% off so check the website as well okay uh, enjoy the test see you in the next video <laughs> cheers the extra info I can mention that uh, they both fit into this box and it's a lovely box actually uh, I really recommend this box very uh, strong sturdy I stood on it here on the edges you know no no shaking vibrating whatsoever it was very stable you know so those uh, both saws will fit uh, perfectly into this box uh, really good box well done Ryobi And then the old one.
Okay, so this one is vibrating actually even more jumping. Jumping much more. Whereas this one, let's see again. The newer one. Yeah, much, much less. Much less. So maybe it's the blade. Let's change the blade. Swap the blades. That's jumping a lot. Let's get the new one with the old blade. Much better, it doesn't jump. You know, I, I'm not doing anything else. This one just goes. I mean, it's Okay, we've got a, a nail here, okay. Let's try without the nail. Okay, goes well. The old one. loses power and jumps a bit as well, maybe because of that. Much more powerful, much more powerful. Okay, uh, let's check the batteries, the both three, and this one is three as well. I recently charged them. So, quality of the card, I mean, I think this says it all, yeah? This says it all.